Guys, today is the wonderful day. It's pretty late at night, but we got a delivery. Agatha is going crazy down here. Um, yeah, so the first, the first guy, we actually didn't expect it to be assembled already. We thought that it would come in a box and Toyota will be assembling it, but it's assembled. And I don't know why they painted so many things here. I hope I can remove it. It's kind of dirty, actually. <laughs> Second guy. <laughs> it's pretty late, but I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> now we have no space here, literally. We need to put everything no, in another room. Adeline is eating in the kitchen. <laughs> Good afternoon, not morning, afternoon. And I'm excited about today because I need to organize things today. I have them here because I need to wash them first and then they will go to that room. And what I'm the most excited about is that we didn't have any storage space at all for the, like since September, it's how, how many? Five? Five months? And all of our things like clothes, books, everything is just laying in piles in that room in the middle of living room and bedroom it's just a storage room everything is laying in piles in like boxes suitcases just piles <laughs> you know on the floor and this was driving me crazy because these things they are never organized everything is a mess you can't find anything kids like throw them around like for the for the for the last five months, this was just like crazy. So finally, we have these guys. I'm super excited. Um, yeah, but they are super dirty. So you probably can see it better today in the light. So these guy, Agatha is <laughs> showing <laughs> on the floor. So these this is very dirty. Like like wow. This is super dirty. Like you can see that. Um, yeah. So these are new, but they brought them like this without any boxes or anything. And I can't really do anything with that. This is like normal for them to bring them this in this condition. <laughs> so yeah, I can't really tell them anything. They will not care at all. But I was quite shocked yesterday. I was like, wow, I didn't expect them to be dirty with markers and assembled. I mean, I like that they're assembled, but I would prefer them to be clean and in boxes <laughs> than assembled. They also put some markers, like black markers. I don't know if I can wash it off, like on the white furniture, black markers, like why? Why did they do that? I don't know. And this mirror, it has, like you can see it. I mean, I can only scratch it. So yeah, I need to wash it now really well before we can move them to another room. Yes, yes. Did them? Cuckoo. Cuckoo. It doesn't help. <laughs> I'm scared to scratch it because it's glass and I'm kind of worried that I'll scratch the glass. Two hours later, but I think I did a good job. I still need to wash it properly, but I scratched off the markers. Mm -hmm. 
собой помочь. Угу. Могу. Ку-ку. Окей, guys, the moment of truth. Let's see. Oh, it's so bad. Okay. It's so bad. Um, why would anybody do that? Like, why would anybody put black markers on the white furniture? And the worst thing is that here it's inside, but on the other wardrobe it's outside. Like, Well, kinda, you still can see it, right? <sighs> so, it takes a little longer than I expected and I want to have lunch now. But it is... I feel like this video is getting more and more chaotic, but we already, we already put everything in places. Um, we had unexpected guests yesterday and so I finished washing that giant wardrobe, Tola washed everything else and we just put everything in places very quickly. And this is the one that is kind of organized, but all the rest, <laughs> I'll just show you. Kids are reading a book in Georgian. Well, they just look at the pictures. So, as I said, this cutie is the only organized one. Here are all the books, books, books. 
books. I really love these series. They're so beautiful. Um, they're just some random stuff that, like this I don't know where to put yet. And the rest of the books is for giving away. And here, uh, I just put some of the board games. I didn't get all the board games. I just put some that I found right away. And I tried to teach the kids to not touch them yeah, without me. So going to that room, everything else is here. So this is the living room. This is the go through room and this is the bedroom. Uh, we put wardrobes here, big wardrobe here. There are some diapers I put uh, on top. There is a bed that we didn't assemble yet. Yesterday we had very limited time. We just put everything in here and I kind of took all of our clothes that we had and I just <laughs> stuffed it inside like everywhere. Like, just like yeah, and then this part was empty, but when the guests went away, I just put in the evening everything here. So, as I said, I had a little bit of time to organize the shelf, not fully, but a little bit. There are just through random stuff in here, my sewing machine, some bed sheets and some diapers. Kind of fine, but still needs to organize this part and maybe put a little bit more clothes on hangers. I would like to have some better organization system, especially for bed sheets. But for now, it kind of works. I mean, we, as always, I mean, we didn't have any storage space at all for quite a while. And our stuff was just laying in like, boxes and suitcases and in the piles on the floor so even with no organization system having wardrobes is just so nice and i also found a nice little spot for um the vacuum cleaner because there's a little niche um it didn't have its place before but now i think it's kind of a good one this. <laughs> I love the shit. I love the shit. Mm -hmm. I give kids food because it's the only way to keep them more or less quiet while I'm filming because otherwise they just cry all the time. <laughs> so if you think that kids are always just chill and they can film whatever I want 99% of the time, it's not. It's not like that. They just interrupt me every five seconds and I stop recording, I deal like do what they ask me to, like take care of them, then I start recording again. And it's like all day long. They're not usually allowed to eat not at the table, so like walking around. So they're excited and at least Adeline is happy. Agatha just wants to sit with me now. <laughs> so my plan didn't work that well. So yeah, I have just a random random pile of clothes just put in here to kind of hide from people. <sighs> so I really need to take it out and organize. Oh, by the way, by the way, check this out. Boom. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. This is a costume dress for um, ballet dancing. Agatha does uh, ballet dance dancing yeah, yeah. classes and they had a concert recently and it was her first performance with the group but it was so cool. I also have like in these wardrobes I also have a bunch of clothes that either are too big for Agatha or too small for Agatha, too big for Adeline, you know, like clothes that are in between children's sizes, but I want to keep them because children grow fast and if clothes are in good condition, I usually pass them from the oldest to the youngest. Sometimes our friends 
can give some clothes from their kids and if they also are in good condition and uh, if my kids also keep them just in case like for Agatha I have vacuum bags and these clothes were in vacuum bags but while I was putting everything in places yesterday kids found the vacuum bags and took everything out as always so yeah I usually hide them somewhere very very far where kids can't reach them I have organizers just just two or I think four there are a couple more somewhere I need more organizers but we need to see how they work in the wardrobes first before getting more is to keep children's clothes at the lower ones two for Edo and two for Agatha I think and then two for me two for Tora I want uh, the lower ones to be for children because they can take clothes themselves this way I think I'll just put aside all, all the clothes that are for sure not going into the wardrobes first and then We'll see what is left. And then I think I'll just throw the ones that I know for sure will go into the wardrobes here. And then I'll organize them accordingly. To... I think I also need to probably throw away or give away some of the clothes. I'm not sure. I didn't go through them in a couple of months. So I told you they, they took out all of the vacuum bags, like everything. Very oversized t-shirt. I also usually keep seasonal clothes away. Like um like shorts and dresses that they don't wear right now. So these will be only for winter, spring type of clothes. This is also goes to the garbage bin. This is from a doll. This is not a kid size. This one, it takes literally all the space, like it's so big. But Agatha likes it, so it's her favorite home, home, uh, how do you call it? Hoodie? A hoodie to wear at home. It's very soft. Do you have? Да, очень красиво. Молодец. Да. They're getting closer and closer. Все, довольно. Вот сайт. If I downstairs neighbors will ever see this. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. It feels like I'm almost done, but in reality, I need to organize all of that. Agatha has more bags than I. <laughs> Okay, so I now think that Agatha doesn't have that much clothes. <laughs> so I think Agatha is put putting more and more clothes on her. I think either most of the kids' clothes are in the laundry, which can be. Or maybe I throw away 
some of them. <laughs> um, I don't know, but it looks like Agatha has nothing in this wardrobe, where actually it should be t-shirts, uh, home leggings, underwear, like tights. These cute things are also going here. I also have dresses for her, but I'm thinking about putting them in the wardrobe on the rail. So, let's see if there will be enough space on the rail. Yes, I think all the kids' clothes are in the laundry because let's just wash everything. Okay, they take a lot of space. They take a lot of space, but it's going to be summer, summer soon and we'll just put these away, so that's okay for now. The laundry pile is getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> so maybe some of the t-shirts are here and I also have a bag and a couple of vacuum bags that I plan to use for storing these clothes. I actually went to this room to hide from children, but it didn't work. Adel Adelina, не трогай мой штатив. You can find me anywhere. These will be Adeline's clothes a little bit later in the future. Maybe this summer, maybe next summer. I just put everything for Adeline when she gets bigger a little bit in one big vacuum bag. With these um, clothes, I'll put just all the shoes in the bag. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Have a pile for babies. Agatha is pretending she can speak English. So this is what we have. Um, I have no idea where I'm going to store it. Um, I'm thinking about getting some beans on top of uh, the big wardrobe, getting rid of the diapers that are there. Um, yeah, but for now, I think I'll just throw them somewhere in the storage room. <laughs> So yeah, um, thank you guys a lot for staying with us for today and see you in my next video. Bye bye.